All right, let's do it. Let's get ready to rock sequence one. All right, we're gonna start. It is upper focus today. That's what Wednesday is. However, it's still a full body workout. Still got the lower half, first one, leaving nothing up to the imagination here. Arms overhead, make sure those shoulders stay tucked. Call that the closed back position. Get about shoulder width, sit back heavy in the heels, keep your chest tall. We're just gonna do your arms overhead, body weight squats. Try to find some rhythm and knock them out. Remember, on our way up, drop through the heels, we wanna avoid that, right? So we grab it out through the knee as well. If I were to put my finger on the outside of your knee, I feel a little bit of pressure. We're gonna limit the range of motion. It's gonna be a little, uh, might be uh, affected a little, a little bit from getting your arms up overhead. And just make sure the chest is staying tall and you're staying back, sitting back into the heels. All right, but even though you're sitting in the heels, still think of your foot like a tripod. You still want the front two points of contact on the floor. You're just gonna be heavy in the back point of contact. One minute. Then we got a plank with a plus. You're going to be in a plank, but you're going to be doing uh, some serratus work. So what's going to happen is on the forearms, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let my shoulder blades kiss, and then I'm going to drive myself out the way. So I'm driving myself away from the floor, like I'm driving my shoulders out of my socket here. And then kiss, uh, kiss them, drive off the floor, kiss. Before. It's going to feel a little funky, but if you train that red dot before, whatever we do, a press with a plus, that's the same idea. Working this little guy, the serratus muscle right here. Some might call it the, the fish scales. Or fish gills, excuse me, not scales. And then uh, final exercise, the V up. Everything working on the V up. Lean your Repeat the middle. So driving the torso completely off the floor. You need an option for that. Go ahead. You don't gotta roll the upper body completely up. You can just bend at the knee. Remember, if you're not, if you're doing the extra, if you're not doing the option for progression, you're driving that torso off, kind of reaching up. On the feet. Any questions? Remember overhead, overhead squat, plank with a plus, and then you get the V up. All right, cool. All right, everyone, we'll get going here. Got the clock. What's up, Casey? Glad to join. Glad of you to join. Three, two, one, and go. Overhead, sit back in the heels, keep the chest tall. And hip full extension, so don't stop here. Drive the butt all the way in. Exhale as you drive up. Halfway through. All right, everyone get ready to hit the floor for the plank for the plus here. We're going in three, two, one, go. Straight and strong, kiss the shoulder blades, drive yourself away from the floor. It's tedious, but effective. Remember, you really gotta, we're halfway through here. And 15 seconds, we'll flip it over, V up. 
Good job, Josh. In three, two, one, and flip it over. The V up. Exhale as you drag your torso up off the floor. Meet the feet in the middle. Thirty seconds. Fifteen seconds. Almost there. We rest in three. Two, one, and rest, everyone. Drink water if you need to. Focus on breathing. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Hope everyone's staying cool. Almost there, we got 15 seconds and it's go time. All right, remember overhead squat. We're going in three, two, one, and do it. Remember, the full extension at the top. You finish here with that butt all the way, squeeze it at the top, butt all the way extended in your hips. And just knock them out. Once you get rid of them, just go. Heavy in the heels. All right, everyone, we're just past halfway. All right, in 10 seconds, we got the plank with plus. Let's get ready to rock. Remember, kiss shoulder blades. Explode off the floor. Three, two, one, and switch it. You're here. Kiss them. Boom. You're going to drive yourself away from the floor. Remember, if you can, keep your butt squeezed. Keep that plank straight and strong. We got about 20 seconds. All right, get ready to flip it over for the V up. But let's flip it over. Three, two, one, go. Exhale as you're driving that torso off the floor.
Almost there. We got about 15 seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Just like that. Casey's bored. I saw that. All right, everyone, great job. Recover, we do it one more time than sequence two. And it goes quick, 15 seconds. Already back with the overhead squat. Round three, thou. Here it comes. All right, we're going in three, two, one, and go. Trying to get at least parallel with your thighs. Keep the chest tall, looking good, Robin. 30 seconds. All right, in 15, you're hitting the deck. Plank with plus. Uh, Jaden, get those, keep that chest tall. There you go. And plank with plus, we're going in three, two, one, go. Keep those shoulders away from your earlobes, too. You keep it tucked in your armpits. And we just passed halfway on this one. In 15 seconds, you're gonna flip it over, hit the V up. All right, let's flip it over. V up, final minute of sequence one. Three, two, one, go. Just pass halfway. Almost there. And three, two, one, done, everybody. Whoa. That was fun. Great job. Drink some water. If you uh, not too much though, we don't want to. We don't want to come it back up. Sequence two. How'd that go? Done. All right, everyone. Mike push up. We've done it before. If you're new to the Wednesday session. Um, this could be your first time doing it, but if you've been taking this Wednesday session with me for a while, then you ran into before. How about a couple, one thing 
about this is the most common error I see, right? You're in a plank kind of like a hard position, so your butt's up in the air. That thing I tell you not to do 90% of the time, we're actually going to do. However, we don't want to get the arm so far out in front of us that it comes into a kind of a weird tricep extension. You want to keep your arms actual push up level. So just like you would if you were doing a regular push up, but this time your butt's just in here, right? So what it is is putting a lot more emphasis on the deltoids. It's up for focus. You got to get the shoulder work in, and uh, of course, I feel like it's one of the best ways to do it. We're doing body work stuff. Remember to lock out each and every time. Your legs don't have to be completely extended. I can't. My hamstrings are too tight. But you want to make sure that you're high enough where you get a good angle so you're feeling it majority, majority, majority in the shoulders. I think I watched that. <laughs> you, you get what I'm saying. Then alternating lateral lunge with plyo. Sit the butt back. The leg you don't step with is going to stay extended. Chest tall. Drive up through the heel. Power up the floor, quick transition, keep the chest tall, back and forth. Hopefully you got enough real estate to make this work. Is that that's not working for you? Just give me an alternating lateral lunge. Most common error is probably this. Like I said, really focus on sitting the butt back and keeping the chest tall. I really don't care how deep you go. We just want to, when we drive off that foot, we want enough power we can kind of just skip right into the next lunge. And then this one, side plank rotation. This one I'm gonna, I'm gonna have us do minute, minute, 30, 30. So, I'll give you this angle. Because we, what we don't want is this. You wanna keep your blood tucks on the side plank. And you wanna keep the rotation nice and controlled. You're gonna reach under and then rotate up. If you want, you can split your legs like that. Reach under, rotate up. Keep the hip high, you don't want to avoid a different option here. That means staying on the ground and the hips still stay tall. Minute, minute, third round, 30, 30. Any questions? Thumbs? Nice. All right, everyone. High push up to begin. We're going in three. Two, one, and go. You need an option for that one, and you got like a chair or a sofa near you. You can put your feet on or knees on the sofa or the chair. And we're halfway. All right, everyone, get ready. We're about to be on our feet. We're about to be doing the alternating lateral lunge with plyo. On the feet, three. Two, one, and go. Up and over. Up and over. Once you get the rhythm, you can really get going. Make sure it's controlled. That all looking good. The Whitney's very sharp. Good job, Neil. A little, little deeper there, Case. I know I harp on you don't got to go that deep, but I think you got, there you go. Halfway. Oh, the Callias are killing it here. I hope I pronounced that right. All right, get ready. We're going to. Uh, Shit, what are we doing? Oh yeah, side plank rotation. Let's pick a side. Three, two, one, and go. Here, up, here, up. Nice and controlled. Keep the body straight and strong.
Reach under, rotate up. Remember, all one minute on this side here. Thirty seconds. Ten seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Great job, everyone. You get a minute. Thirty seconds. Back to the pike push up. <laughs> All right. Pike push up. Deltoids really get it this sequence. We're doing it in three. Two, one, go. All right, we got about 15 seconds. All right, to the feet, alternating lateral lunge with plyo. Three, two, one, and go. We're halfway, dial looking sharp. Good job, Chase. Josh, good tempo. We got 15 seconds. And then you're gonna be on the other side doing the side plank. So the opposite side of what you did round one. Let's do it, three. Two, one, and pick a side. Well, not pick a side, opposite side. Nice and controlled, keep it straight and strong. Fifteen seconds, and then we rest. Reach under, rotate up, reach all the way under through the body. Keep the butt tucked. Three, two, one, rest. There you go. All right, here comes round number three.
Oh man, I got a little bit of delay going on with my feet here. Oh, we're good. Never mind. Corrected itself. At about 30 seconds, it's go time. I hope everyone's AC is working today. All right, everyone, guess what? Pike push up. We go in three. Two, one, and do it. We're halfway through. We got 15 seconds. Shoulders are burning. Boulder shoulders, that's what we're going for here. Wednesday TTPC crew, upper focus. All right, let's go ahead and get up to the feet. Alternating plyo lunge, three, two, one and go. Good tempo here. It's the last time you're doing them. We're halfway. Fifteen. All right, this time we're gonna go half and half, 30-30. So start with the side, I guess you can start with any side on that side plank. We're going in three, two, one, side plank, rotation, nice and controlled, of course. And let's go ahead, let's switch to that other side. Three, two, one, and switch. Almost there. Three, two, Oh, one rest, everyone. Great job, recover. Third and final. All right. Great job, everyone. Two down, one to go. This one for me personally would, would be a doozy, but you might like it, I don't know. Everyone's a little different. Everyone's got their exercises they enjoy. So we got wide grip, push up, but hand release push up. So we've done a variation of these uh, before in this Wednesday upper focus TVC, but we never put them together. So we've done the hand release push up, we've done the wide grip push up, but we haven't done a combination of the two. So first time today. So we're going to go real wide with your grip, your hands are off the floor, up. And then release your hands each and every time. Keeping the body straight, you want to avoid that. And of course, you want to avoid this, right? Everything, keep the butt tight, 
real wide. And then lock out. Next exercise, you don't got to do much because you're going to stay right down here, but you're going to go up down. So you're going to go here, up, boom, jump, back down, boom, jump, back down. You don't have to jump. You can do calf raise. You can also lock. Lock. But on your way up, try to avoid this. So I rounded my back, trying to get that chest up on the jump, and then do it. Third exercise. Down on the floor, single leg glute bridge. Squeeze butt, drive hip up, down. Squeeze butt, drive up through the heel, down. Down. We'll go 30 30 on that one, all three rounds. Wide grip hand release, up down with jump. Single leg group glute bridge, 30-30. Yeah, my thing's on a delay right now. Hope you guys are having, aren't having trouble seeing what I'm doing or anything. All right. One minute. Hand release. Wide grip. We're going in three. Two, one, and go. We're halfway. Fifteen seconds, and then we got up downs with the jump. Real wide with the grip. Good job, Whitney's. Three, two. One, let's go up, down. A little jump at the top, like a sprawl, then you're up. Very well done. Good job, Jody. We're about halfway through. Fifteen. All right, let's go ahead and get ready to hit the deck. Single leg glute bridge. Pick a side, three, two, one, and go. Squeeze your butt, drive up through the heel. Very well done. Try to drive, try to get those hips at full extension if you can, not the end of the world if that can't happen. Peach farming, thou. It never stops. They're always in season. All right, let's go ahead, let's switch legs. We're gonna switch in three, two, one, and switch. Three, two, one, I'll rest it. Fantastic job, everybody.
We're halfway through the recovery. We're getting there. We are getting there. All right, Christina Dunn, your time to shine here. Hand release push up, wide grip. We're going in three, two, one, and do it. Obnoxiously wide. Explode off the floor, keeping your body straight and strong. Good job, Josh. Good job, Neil. We just passed halfway this exercise. And let's go get ready for the up down. Conditioning, we're going in three, two, one, and go. Sprawl down, chest up, little jump. Great job, Jody. And Jaden, well done. Keeping up with mom, very impressive. Or should I say mom, keeping up with you? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. We're halfway through. Good job, Casey. Let's hit the deck. Let's get ready for that glute bridge. Single leg, three, two, one and go. Squeeze butt, drive up through the heel. Try to hit full extension if you can. All right, let's get ready to switch it. Three, two, one, and switch. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Ah, all right, final round. Almost there, everyone. I was gonna say, then, then you can go out and uh, enjoy the weather, but I think probably majority of us are gonna stay inside in the AC, at least until the evening time. Uh-oh, we're about 10 seconds away. Wide grip push-up. Hand release, that is, of course. Let's go ahead and do it. Three, two, one, and go.
And we're halfway, 30 seconds. And let's go ahead, hit that up, down the sprawl with the jump. Three, two, one, go. Last time you're going to have to worry about this one. And halfway. We got about 15 seconds. Three, two, a one, let's pick a side, a single leg loop bridge, final minute of work, three, two, one, do it. All right, let's get ready to switch. Let's go ahead, switch it to that opposite leg. Final 30 seconds, three, two, one, go. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one, you're done. You are done. Look at that a little early too. What a day. High five. Yes, you go Thou. Let's go enjoy that 100 degree heat. Great job everyone. Always a pleasure seeing you guys. Um, wish I had a date for you when we're, we're getting, we're, we'll, the, you know, for actually doing this in person, uh, I don't. But hopefully it's coming soon. Soonish at least, huh? All right, everyone. It was always, it was fun. Uh, tomorrow's Tyler, same time, butts, guts, and uh, and uh, abs. Wait, no, butts, guts, and I think a little bit of stretch, the stretchy stuff at the end, a little some Brazil, um, some mobility. Good class. With that being said, until next week. Bye, Whitney's. Bye, Robin. Later, Josh.